Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. Are you thinking of getting an antivirus program for your system, but aren't sure which one suits your needs? Well, I'm gonna help you out today. I'll be sharing my list of the top six antivirus software programs for Windows in 2023. I'll also be discussing which ones are the best for what specific purposes, so you can easily pick the one that fits your situation. And if at any point you'd like to check out any of these services, I'll drop discounted links down in the description below that'll help you save a bit of extra money. To begin with, Bitdefender has been the talk of the town and for good reason. It's a great choice for a malware scanner with excellent web and device protection. It's packed with multiple high performance features like a VPN, a password manager, system tune-ups, front to controls, anti-theft protocols, ransomware remediation, and many, many more features. Not to mention that Bitdefender lets you try out their service risk-free for 30 days with its money back guarantee. Seriously, when it comes to dealing with malware, Bitdefender puts up a tough fight. Now, not many antiviruses offer ransomware remediation to restore your files after a ransomware attack. But Bitdefender's a lifesaver in such cases. And let me tell you, for my online transactions, I always prefer to use SafePay through Bitdefender. Using this safe browser ensures that my information stays secure every time that I make a purchase online. Now, interestingly enough, Bitdefender received top scores in independent antivirus tests. But I still wanted to test it myself against malware that I intentionally planted on my PC. And boy, did it, did it impress me. Although it took about 45 minutes for Bitdefender to complete a full deep dive scan into my PC, it's outstanding standing malware detection was totally worth the wait. It managed to identify and delete all 10 of the malicious files that I intentionally planted on my device. But one downside was that during the scan, it used about 70 to 85, maybe 90% of my CPU usage. So yeah, a deep bit defender scan can load your system to the point where you won't be able to multitask so easily. And in terms of functionality, we highly recommend that you go with one of their premium plans. The differences are clear and the premium one is just that much better. Plus, each premium plan adds extra functionality, so you'll get more value for your money with every higher plan. And let me reassure you that these plans are really reasonable. The prices range from about 50 bucks a year for the basic and around 80 bucks a year for the premium plan. This is really reasonable, especially when you consider all the awesome features they come with. I mean, in some cases, some companies charge just as much or more for what Bitdefender is throwing in. So all these things considered, I firmly believe Bitdefender is the best antivirus out there for your PC in 2023. By the way, if you want to check out Bitdefender, I have a discount code that'll get you up to 67% off your first year. So feel free to check it out while it lasts. So next up on my list is Norton 360, which has everything you need in an antivirus for Windows 10 as well. It's like an all-in-one package packed with AI powered threat detection, ransomware protection, a smart firewall, and vulnerability monitoring, and that's not even the whole story. In terms of the money-back guarantee, Norton is more generous than Bitdefender as it allows for a 60-day risk-free trial, which shows me that they are really confident in their service. Now, independent antivirus tests have consistently given top marks to Norton for Windows, and I can confidently say that my own tests align with those results. So when I tried Norton, its full scan did take a bit longer than Bitdefender's clocking in at around an hour, but it it managed to detect nine out of the 10 malware files that I intentionally planted on my device. Almost perfect, but still under Bitdefender. Now, when it comes to pricing, Norton is a bit more expensive than Bitdefender, starting at around 20 bucks a year for the most basic plan and getting up to as much as about 100 bucks a year for the highest tier plan. But unlike Bitdefender, the basic plan of Norton has many essential features for casual users. But if you're looking for a premium features like parental control, a VPN, a smart firewall, and more, it is best to opt for a higher package which is what we almost always do, and here was no exception. So overall, I'd say Norton Antivirus is like an all-inclusive option specifically tailored for Windows 10. It's got all the goods to keep your system protected and secure. My third pick, Avira Antivirus, has been around for ages now. Avira is a good malware detection engine with a lot of helpful features and an intuitive cross-platform app. Though Avira is not nearly as good as Bitdefender or Norton in terms of web protection, it's still fairly good for a beginner as it backs every purchase with a 60-day money-back guarantee. And although in terms of actual protection, Avira doesn't quite hit the mark, especially compared to Bitdefender or Norton, it still gained quite a good reputation among various independent testing organizations. Based on my experience and test results, I believe Avira does offer a good security for Windows. And it's not just about real-time protection, it also handles ransomware, similarly to how Bitdefender does. But here's the interesting part. Avira offers a range of optimization options for Windows that are pretty diverse. From optimizing your laptop's battery life to helping you find duplicate files and free up memory, Avira does it all while keeping an eye out for any potential online or local threats, which I think is really cool. 
there are several independent tests that give Avira top scores in terms of security and performance, and my own results don't contradict them either. Avira is the fastest compared to Bitdefender and Norton. It took only about 20 minutes for Avira to run the full system scan, which was really impressive to me. But during the scan, Avira did allocate about 40% of the memory and utilize between 60 to 90% of the CPU, so it is a bit resource heavy, but hey, it gets the job done quickly. While Avira does offer a free version, I wouldn't say it's the best free antivirus for Windows 10. It's got good baseline features, enough for casual users, but the paid plans provide more essential features that you should have in an antivirus. So considering that Avira antivirus offers most of the basics for free, I see it as a valuable option for beginner users. Now let's talk about Total AV. It's got all the essentials you could possibly need. It's an amazing malware scanner with an outstanding detection rate, excellent anti-phishing site detection, and a lot of good web protection features. It's got several fancy features such as a VPN, a password manager, and a highly intuitive interface, among many others. When it comes to baseline defense, Total AV has got you covered with real-time protection, a firewall check for online security, a web shield, and a safe search feature for optimization. It even takes care of managing junk and duplicate files, browser history, and unused applications they've really got you covered. Now, Total AV speed are remarkable. Full scans for Total AV on Windows typically take around 20 minutes, which is pretty amazing, but here's the catch. During my scan, it consumed around 70 to 80% of the CPU power, and it stayed that way throughout most of the scan. So if you're looking to run a full scan while working on your computer, Total AV might not be the best option as it does strain your system resources. But the best part about it is that it's free antivirus plans guarantee quite a lot of essential features you might need in your antivirus for Windows. But nevertheless, paid plans definitely give you some extras to enjoy, such as a VPN, password manager, access on multiple devices. What's more, Total AV prices are quite reasonable and accessible. So all in all, Total AV is definitely worth considering, especially if you're looking for an antivirus that covers all the basics and won't break the bank. Now, despite how infamous McAfee used to be, it's one of the best antiviruses in 2023. It's a powerful malware detector with perfect detection rates for cyber threats, as well as real-time malware. Just like others on my list, McAfee also offers extras like a password manager, parental control, a VPN, and anti-theft protocols. Moreover, the 30-day refund policy of McAfee allows you to check it out risk-free. McAfee's Windows security covers everything that you need. It's got you covered with robust local security, including top-notch ransomware protection and powerful scanning capabilities. On top of that, it offers strong online protection with its web advisor browser extension. I mean, even the latest AV comparatives gave McAfee for Windows full scores in every category, protection, performance, and usability. And even in my own tests, McAfee lived up to the hype. It successfully dealt with the malware I threw at it, and I was in complete awe of the speed with which McAfee scanned through my PC. It breezed through everything in just around 12 to 15 minutes, which is really, really remarkable. Another thing that I really like about McAfee is that I can have it on all of my devices. Even the cheapest plan allows me to protect up to five devices. And if you opt for the family plan, you can extend that coverage to a whopping 10 devices. That's more generous than any other plan I've come across. And if that's not enough, the LifeSafe plan lets you protect an unlimited number of devices. So when it comes to antivirus options for multiple devices, McAfee is hands down the best choice. It offers top-notch protection, impressive performance, and the convenience of covering all your devices without breaking the bank. And in the end, I can't overlook Kaspersky either. It's come a long way in improving its transparency and recognition by offering impressive protection against malware and some extras like parental controls, VPN, password manager, and the rescue disk. It also comes with a money back guarantee of up to 30 days to help you check it out risk free. Now, Kaspersky's delivery of the top notch malware protection truly impresses me. What I personally love are all the privacy protection features it offers. It's like having a vigilant guard, keeping an eye out for any tracking attempts, effectively blocking data collection, and even preventing audio and visual recordings. And when it comes to antivirus tests, Kaspersky for Windows consistently receives the highest scores, and let me tell you, it's well-deserved. But in my own test, I did encounter a little setback. While Kaspersky successfully dealt with most of the malware, the full scan took almost two hours. That's definitely not ideal, and it left me feeling a bit underwhelmed. But on the brighter side, when it comes to malware removal, Kaspersky nailed it. My PC got rid of 9 out of the 10 malwares in my test, so that's definitely a win. Unfortunately, like most other antiviruses, Kaspersky also offers only basic security for free. When it comes to pricing, Kaspersky's basic plan starts at around 42 bucks a year, and the highest one will cost around 82 bucks a year. So if you want protection against ransomware or added privacy features, you'll have to shell out a bit more. 
It's a trade-off, but overall Kaspersky is an antivirus that delivers great performance and solid protection. So if you're looking for an antivirus with impressive malware protection and advanced privacy features, Kaspersky is definitely worth considering. Before I wind up, let's summarize first. Bitdefender takes the crown for the best antivirus overall with top-notch protection. Now, if you want to go with the best all-inclusive option, Norn is the way to go. Then, if you're a beginner, there's nothing better than Avira because of its intuitiveness. Total AV is perfect for you if you're just looking for the essentials and don't want to get overwhelmed with unnecessary features. If you want to protect multiple devices without breaking the bank, then McAfee is the best bet. And finally, when it comes to reliable performance and protection, Kaspersky does also stand out. So that's all for today, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Consider subscribing because that helps in providing you with fresh content every single week. And if you want any of the deals that we mentioned, you can check them out in the links down in the description below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.